morning, everyone. We are on week three of this term with memory verses. And today's memory verse is also known as the golden rule. Now, some of you might not know what the golden rule is, but if I had to say, tell me the golden rule, what is the golden rule? What is that, that known as? It's actually a verse from scripture and it's from the book of Luke. Now, Matthew, Mark, Luke, John, that's from the New Testament. And it's from Luke chapter 6, verse 31, and it goes like this. Do to others as you would have them do to you. It's a simple concept. Do uh, treat others the same way you want to be treated. But I'm not going to stop there. I'm going to carry on reading a few verses and then just briefly share how we can apply this in our lives. So Jesus says, do to others as you would have them do to you. If you love those who love you, What credit is that to you? Even sinners love those who love them. And if you do good to those who do good to you, what credit is that to you? Even sinners do that. And if you lend to those from whom you expect repayment, what credit is that to you? Even sinners lend to sinners, expecting to be repaid in full. We're coming to the end now. But love your enemies, do good to them, and lend to them without expecting to get anything back. Then your reward will be great, and you will be children of the Most High, because he is kind to the ungrateful and wicked. Be merciful, just as your Father is merciful. So, so often people know about the verse or the golden rule, do to others as you want them to do to you. If you're in class and someone comes and complains to the teacher, if I was the teacher and someone came and said, Mrs. Shaw, someone did this, kicked me or whatever, and I turned around and said, Johnny, do to others as you would. Would you want someone to kick you? No, Mrs. Shaw. Well, then don't kick them. That's the concept we're talking about. But if you put it in context, like I've been talking about since we've started these memory verses, Jesus goes on to actually explain. He's talking about that with everyone. He's not just talking about that with those we love, like your family. Although sometimes if I hear disagreements within my children's lives. So they love each other, but they still get irritated. But Jesus is not just talking about people that we love. He's talking about strangers. He's talking about everyone out there. We need to treat others, anyone, the person off the street that we don't know, the way we would want to be treated. And the key to this, the word that I'm going to use, is love. That is the difference between just doing good to others because you know them or because you care for them compared to doing good to everyone treating everyone if if the world treat if everyone treated each other the way they would want to be treated imagine the better world we would live in so it's such an important important uh, scripture so it's actually become known as the golden rule to treat others the way we want to be treated It comes in in the book of Luke just after Jesus talks about the Beatitudes. Now, some of you might have heard the, the scriptures that start like this. Blessed are you who are poor, for yours is the kingdom of God. Blessed are you who hunger, and it carries on with blessed, blessed. This is at a time where Jesus was, so many people had heard about this man named Jesus, and he was sharing so much um, knowledge and and rules and about how to live godly lives, how to live good lives, and he attracted quite a, a crowd who'd followed him. And um, th- this is the time that he after the, after those sharing the beatitudes and the sermons on the mount and all of those things, where crowds had followed him to hear about him. He talks about this: do to others as you would want them to do to you. And he's not just meaning the people that you love. He's talking about your enemies, the people that are really mean to you sometimes as well. Treat them the way you want to be treated. And hopefully that that love will be able to rub off on them. So that is from Luke chapter 6, verse 31. Do to others as you would have them do to you. That's our memory verse for this week. Let's end in prayer. Father God, thank you for the fact that your your word is just filled with so much amazing um, teaching, amazing just lessons of how to live godly lives. And help us to apply these verses as we go through each week. Help, help them to be sealed to our hearts. 
where we're in tough situations, where we actually maybe want to just be mean back, help us to remember the scripture, where we actually treat others the way that we would want to be treated, despite the situation, despite who it is, despite how they're behaving to us. Help us to apply these truths that we might be able to be lights amongst our friends, amongst our peers, amongst our family, um, just amongst those that, that come into our contact with us. We pray this in and through your name. Amen. 